Today I'm sharing casual spring outfits, styling denim jeans for 2021. I'm a big lover of jeans. I find them one of the comfiest pieces in my entire capsule wardrobe. They're easy to dress up or down, and thanks to a whole host of beautiful fashion brands, there's a cut for every woman's body shape. Having created my spring capsule wardrobe recently, I noticed that I don't really seem to have a favorite type. I've got a little bit of everything for all different occasions. So I thought you might enjoy seeing my styling ideas with jeans for this spring, with lots of different everyday outfit ideas. If you're already subscribed, would you mind just double checking that you've got all notifications clicked on the tab? It won't spam you or anything, it will just send you a quick reminder each time I upload a new video. And at the end of this video, if you'd like to follow me on all my other social platforms as well, I've added links in the description box below. So first of all, to a look that I'm already wearing on repeat this spring. So as you can see in this footage, I'm wearing my puff sleeve blouse that I absolutely love. I got that last summer from Cezanne. Now it's called the Anton blouse and I will link it in the description box below, but it has recently come back in stock. So if you're lucky, you might be able to grab yourself one of those. So a really nice look for this spring would be to pair one of your favorite pairs of jeans with a statement blouse like this. The blouse, of course, becomes the star of the show. I think dressing it down with sandals and that bucket bag gives it an overall feel of effortless chic, which I really love. To so have a play dressing down some of your own statement blouses or shirts that you might have in your wardrobe. It's a really easy way to turn something that is seen as dressed up into more of an everyday look. Before I forget, do let me know in the comments section below your favorite outfit that I feature today. Even if it's that you really detest my flare jeans, as I know they're going to be a Marmite piece, I personally really like to hear everyone's different opinions. In this next outfit idea, I did the opposite to what I did before. Dressing down my high-waisted jeans with a really comfy organic cotton jumper that I have in this deep coffee tone. And then dressing it back up again with those high tan sandals. I love these kind of heels for an everyday look. They give you a bit of height and they're super comfy and yet they don't feel too dressed up to wear in the daytime. Rather than go with tan accessories, I wanted to add a touch of black. So I've mixed in both my sunglasses and my belt with that classic numero un Palen handbag. It's a smart but casual look and definitely something I would wear on an everyday basis. I can do a styling jeans for spring video and not include at least one double denim look. My favorite way to interpret that trend would be just like this, really dressing it down, keeping it a very casual everyday look. I've added a sprinkle of blush with my vest top underneath and added my lovely pastel blue jumper over my shoulders so I've got it there just in case. Pretty much any trainers would work, but I personally really like it with high top converse. And the finishing touch would just be to add a nice tote bag. Here I've gone with the Le Cabas that I got from Palen Paris. If you're a fan of skinny jeans, this next look might be for you. Styling my favorite slim fit black jeans with a lovely wrap top that I got recently from a brand called Naked. Finishing touches, I've gone with my two-tone camel handbag and a little bit of height with those Studio Amelia heels that I got from Farfetch. It's a little more dressed up than the other outfits I've shared with you so far, but it's certainly something you could easily get away with for those more dressed up occasions in the daytime. Next up, I'm styling my jeans in a smart but casual way with one of my other favorite blazers I got from Everlane. It's a pretty tonal outfit, but hopefully you'll agree it's quite effective and very easy to recreate. Now, although I got this blazer a while ago, it's one of their classic best-selling pieces, so they tend to keep stock pretty much all year round. It's got a gorgeous oversized shape that can be either dressed up or dressed down depending on what you're doing. To keep the look really streamlined, I've added a square neck blush pink vest underneath, accessorizing with my lovely tan tote bag. But what I love the most about an outfit like this is the contrast of those strappy sandals against the smartness of my top half. I think it still looks polished, but in a really casual, everyday fashion, which suits me just fine. Going for a really classic, timeless spring outfit idea next, 
and one that I'm imagining pretty much everyone would be able to recreate. In this look, I'm styling my cars, straight leg crop jeans that I have in this light blue wash. My top half, I've gone with a classic linen shirt and just tucked that in quite a lot at the front and then lifted it up and over at the back. If you haven't got one already, I would highly advise having a lovely high quality linen shirt in your wardrobe for spring summer. So I shall link some of my favorites I've found recently in the description box below. I've gone with those lovely gold sandals on my feet. They came from a brand called Espadrille, which I shall also link, and finished with my large leather tote. It's a classic outfit idea that never fails to make me feel elevated. My lovely camel blazer got a bit of an outing with this next everyday spring outfit idea. I've kept it tonal with my new Palen Paris handbag. This is the numero un nano version, I believe that's what it's called. And I've kept that element of neutral on my feet with my strappy Studio Emilia heels. This is me very much in my happy place. I feel elevated both literally and aesthetically, but I find blazers really wearable, particularly throughout spring. So it's certainly one of those looks that I do feel most comfortable in. I know it's a bit of a cliche, but if you want to add a bit of a Parisian style to your spring outfit ideas, you can never go wrong with a lovely Breton top. I've got a couple in my wardrobe and I must admit, I find them priceless. They integrate into so many different outfit ideas, layering a cardio over the top or a blazer or a trench coat. They really do work with so many different outfit ideas. This pattern top is more of a classic version, but I like the little twist with those lovely button details on the shoulder. I kept a couple of ankle boots in my spring capsule wardrobe, as I knew I would reach for them when the weather's a little bit changeable like it is at the moment. So here I've paired it with my classic black western boots and added a belt, bag and sunglasses to match. It's effortless, it feels chic, it's comfortable and all of those elements for me are the making of a perfect everyday outfit idea. I showed you a similar outfit idea to this next look in a recent far-fetched lookbook that was on my channel a couple of weeks ago. If you missed that video, I shall link it in the description box below because there were some beautiful pieces. But it's worth featuring this kind of outfit idea again because it's fast become one of my favorites. Styling my flare jeans with this beautiful floral top that I got from Farfetch from a brand called Reformation. This time dressing it right down with a nice pair of gladiator sandals on my feet and finishing with my tan leather bucket bag on my shoulder. This shape of high-waisted flared jeans works really well with these pretty little tops. It just creates a really nice elongating line. It's a little bit 70s, a bit French woman style. Definitely one of my favorite everyday looks. Another take on styling your denim jeans with a classic shirt would be this next outfit idea. This time I've gone with my dark indigo slim parfait jeans that I got from Cezanne. I've had these for a couple of years now, so the cost per wear must be next to nothing. This time with the classic shirt, I've gone with a cotton poplin version that I got in light blue from Arquette recently. The quality of their shirts is impeccable. I would really recommend them. I love the crispness of that cotton poplin and I think they've got the pastel blue shade spot on. You should never underestimate some of the most simple pieces in your wardrobe because they can often create some of the best outfit ideas. Which brings me to this next look wearing my classic white tee that I got recently from Arquette. Now this is the oversized version, so you'll note that those sleeves are just a little bit longer than my other one. I've styled it with my really comfy girlfriend jeans, and as you can see on my feet, my classic white trainers. Obviously I'm going for comfort in this look, but I think the addition of the handbag, a little sprinkle of gold jewelry, and my sunglasses elevates it back up again. This is the sort of look that's become my go-to in the morning, generally in a rush, trying to do the school run. It's easy, it's very comfy, I don't feel too dressed up, and yet I feel polished at the same time. I've gone back to my Everlane straight leg crop jeans in this next look, but this time I'm giving them a little bit more polish. For an actual fact, underneath that trench coat, all I'm wearing is a simple white camisole top. But by layering a really simple outfit like that with a beautiful coat like this one that I got from Batsheva, it makes the whole outfit feel complete. 
keeping it for everyday wear. I didn't want to go too high with my heels. So I've just added those lovely strappy sandals again. And then just finishing with my lovely two-tone numero set handbag and a lovely pair of tortoiseshell sunglasses. And when it comes to everyday outfit ideas that look chic and effortless, this would definitely be one of my favorites. Back to my flares now, but quite a different look to the one I showed you before. Rather than wear them with sandals, this time I've paired them with my white Converse trainers. I like to see that little bit of white trim popping out from underneath. And on my top half, I'm wearing a lovely organic sweater that I got from a brand called Love Sweat and Tees. That jumper quite rightly points out, where is the disco in French? Which I think we'd all like to know right now. I've gone with my classic sunnies and Saint Laurent handbag to finish this outfit idea. I know flares aren't for everybody. They are very much a mom white piece. And I'm not the skinniest person in the world to get away with wearing that shape. But there's something about them that I just love. Probably a little element of the 70s, a sprinkle of Parisian spirit, and a laid back nostalgia that I just love for everyday outfits. Along with Parisian style, one of my other favourite looks, particularly for everyday wear, is to introduce a little bit of a rock chick vibe, which is where I was headed with this next outfit idea. I'm obsessed with this Frankie Shop t-shirt that I've just got in. I absolutely love that shoulder pad detail. It's creating the perfect outfit for me without even having to really try. So styling it with my straight cut denim jeans, these ones came from Everlane. I've added a black leather belt that I got from Naked, my black western boots on my feet. There's something about this t-shirt that really just speaks to my own personal style. And that's what I keep saying in my videos that you really have to try and tune into and follow as much as possible. Because not only will you then feel at your most comfy in your everyday outfit idea, but you'll also look it. That natural style will kind of ooze off you. Thank you so much for watching my 15 everyday outfit ideas styling denim jeans for spring 2021. I really hope you found this video helpful and it's given you some styling inspiration that you can recreate yourself. Don't forget to let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. Maybe you've got a favorite outfit or another favorite way of styling your jeans for spring. It's always really nice to hear from you. And if you're not already subscribed and you like this video and the way I put outfits together, it would be really lovely if you'd like to do so. I will be back next Sunday with even more outfit ideas and styling advice. So hopefully you will join me then. Have a great week and I will see you then.